Hello everyone, uh, my name is Ben Rauscher. Um, I'm from Munich and I'm currently working here at HIGAC in uh, Manual Corpus Lab, Manus Lab. And I'm happy to present to you um, ProRNA.js, which is a BioJS component for visualizing RNA secondary structures on the web. And this is a BioJS component I contributed uh, to the library. So ProRNA.js um, is dynamic. Uh, which means that you can you can click on uh, nucleotides, you can drag them around, you can change the coloring. Um, moreover, ProRNA.js is a pure client side, is purely client side JavaScript, and that's actually what sets it apart from other RNA viewers that are out there. Because that means two things. Uh, first of all, it is a web application, so you don't need to download or install anything. Uh, moreover, it is uh, due to the fact that it's purely on the client. It runs purely on client side. It's like really easy to embed it into any other kind of application, which has been done already. Um, for instance, um, I've been working on this very closely with Björn Grüning from the Galaxy project, and he managed to get it into Galaxy, which I'm like really proud of, as Galaxy is very important um, for bioinformatics right now. Um, and yeah. Moreover, it's part of the BioJS registry, obviously. And uh, what it does is basically it takes an RNA secondary structure encoded by dot bracket notation. An example for that you can see um, on the bottom left uh, of the slide here, where you have your RNA uh, structure, and you have this uh, those dots and brackets. Um, and each dot or bracket corresponds to one uh, of the uh, nucleotides and a pair of brackets always um, signals uh, a hydrogen bond. So it basically describes how hydrogen bonds within the RNA secondary structure work. And what our uh, draw RNA JS does, it passes that, uh, that structure, confer, uh, converts it to a graph data structure and renders it in, in this uh, standard RNA secondary structure <coughs> layout uh, using Cytoscape.js, which is a fantastic um, JavaScript framework um, for network analysis. Um, ProRNHS runs under the MIT Open Software License. And I also have a demo, so let's see if that works. Here you can see the official BioJS homepage. And there you can click on Registry. And you search for, for keywords, or for, in my case, that would be RNA. And there's ProRNHS. And here is a demo of what it looks like. So you can see here, um, you can put in your, uh, uh, your secondary structure. Then you just click on show structure here. And uh, the structure gets displayed. And you can drag nodes around like, like this. Or you can select <coughs> nodes. And it has a, a lasso tool for uh, node selection. So you can precisely select nodes. You can um, you can then select a color you like and you can change it and after you're done you can export it as a PNG and yeah so that's basically it so it's very simple but it does what it does right. thanks very much <laughs>
It is, yes. Yeah. But I didn't come up with that myself. No, so it's just not. Okay. Yeah. okay, thanks, Ben.